California's Governor Gavin Newsom has signed into law what is believed to be first-of-its-kind legislation. The new law, AB 701, specifically targets production quotas in warehouses that may lead to worker injuries. Let's look at what this new legislation is proposing to tackle in this week's NASP Safety News Break. The governor's office says that AB 701 establishes new nation-leading transparency measures for companies to disclose production quota descriptions to their workers and prohibits the use of algorithms that disrupt basic worker rights, such as rest periods, bathroom breaks, or compliance with safety and health laws. The new law also makes it illegal for companies to fire or retaliate against employees who fail to meet an unsafe quota. AB 701 allows the California labor commissioner to access worker comp data to identify facilities with high rates of injury due to the use of unsafe quotas. The law also includes potential citations. It takes effect on January 1, 2022. Although the bill did not specifically name Amazon, it is widely believed that it was conceived to target them. The bill's sponsor, Assemblywoman Lorena Gonzalez, stated, Amazon's business model relies on enforcing inhumane work speeds that are injuring and churning through workers at a faster rate than we've ever seen. Reports published by the Washington Post show that Amazon workers have complained that the company uses computers that show how many items they've stowed, picked, or packed per hour, pressuring them to quote, make rate. Not making rate can lead to termination. The Washington Post's investigation of OSHA injury data found that since 2017, Amazon reported a higher rate of serious injuries that caused employees to miss work or transition to light duty than other warehouse operations in retail. What do you think about California's new law? Do you think it unfairly targets Amazon? Let us know in the comments section below. And don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons so you don't miss the next NASP Safety News Break.